Hey guys, what's going on? This is Mike. In this video, we are continuing our coverage of iOS 8, and today we are checking out the App Switcher. So the first thing that you're going to notice when you invoke the App Switcher is just how much quicker it appears. So compared to iOS 7, when you double tap the Home button, the App Switcher appears much faster, allowing you to have much better navigation in your device. Now aside from being able to view your recent apps and swipe them up to dismiss them, you also have access to your recent contacts at the top of the screen. So as you see there, I have my recent contacts. Those are the contacts that I have uh, texted or called or FaceTime most recently. And if I swipe left, I also have access to my favorites. So what happens if you tap on one of these contacts? Well, like I said before, it will allow you to call the person, FaceTime the person, send a message, you can do FaceTime audio. Uh, basically, every way that you can contact this person will be listed there. I find there's a little bit of a labeling issue there, so as you see, some of the icons are labeled and some aren't. Uh, but that is the app switcher in iOS 8. It opens up much faster and you have access to your recent contacts as well as your favorite contacts. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more, make sure to hit that like button down below. My name is Mike and I'll see you in the next video.